Hi, I'm Vinny from Brisbane, and you're watching The Off Season. Hey, what's up guys? So I just got back from Papua New Guinea yesterday with the Prime Minister's 13 team. We played against Papua New Guinea. I didn't get too much footage. I was just filming on my iPhone. Here's a tiny clip of the stuff that I did get. So we spent four nights in Papua New Guinea and it was truly amazing. Some of the stuff that we did was things that will last with me for a very long time from getting to the airport, arriving and seeing the kids just running along the bus, screaming. You know, they absolutely love their rugby league over there. It's their national sport. To see that was an amazing experience. A lot of the boys, you know, giving away gear and them, the kids just fighting over it. It was uh, pretty crazy scenes. Got to go to the war memorial where three and a half thousand Australian and Papua New Guinea soldiers later rest which was a bit of an emotional experience but something which will last with me for a long time a lot of guys from the Kokoda track are laid to rest there and the youngest grave was about 16 years old so that was a bit sad the game uh, was you know again a great experience in front of a, a hugely packed crowd of guys and girls who just love their footy there was actually one stage where uh, the crowd thought that a light pole was gonna fall on top of them so uh, they stormed the field and the game actually got called off for about 10 minutes while the crowd and the, the police and everyone had to escort everyone off the field. That's something again that I've never seen before and happened in a rugby league game, but to be honest, it was a little bit scary. Boys were over near the tunnel, but uh, the police and everyone assured us that uh, everything would be okay. And they did escort everyone back off the field and then uh, play got back underway. And the ball was very, very slippery. Obviously a lot of sweat in playing in hot conditions above 30 degrees. And uh, then after the game, we, we had a few beers together in the sheds and uh, went back to the hotel and, and just relaxed. And I had an awesome experience. Uh, it's something that I'll definitely remember and it's just crazy uh, what the game of rugby league can do for you. Sorry I didn't get too much footage about the trip uh, this time, but you know, stay tuned for more videos popping up soon.